I'm Annabelle Williams. It's my pleasure to be here today at ACM. Thanks for having me. Never be late, ever. Rule number one, learn your shit, learn your stuff. Don't moan, just just turn up, get on with your job and do it. That way you're, you're reliable, you get rebooked. Get out there, go to open mics, do restaurant gigs, do gigs where no one's listening and you're just practicing, practicing your new songs, you know, and you're trying out new songs and different keys. And if it's in a restaurant and, you know, it's quietly in the background, you know, it doesn't really matter if you go wrong. So don't be nervous because people aren't a lot of the time listening, but it's brilliant for you. It's a really, really good experience. You've got to try everything in order to find out who you are as an artist. Whatever it is you want to do, whether you, you want to be a recording artist, you want to be a backing singer, you want to be an arranger, you want to be a coach, whatever, you've got, to, you've got to do everything. If one week you've tried something and you hate it, it doesn't matter because that is all experience and it's all learning and it's all going towards creating who you are. You've got to try things to be able to eliminate them anyway. Take your time. Don't be in a hurry. It's exactly the same with any instrument, any discipline. Take your time, have patience, you know. When people come and see me for coaching, quite often the first lesson, you won't sing a note. Well, just sort your breathing out. Don't move on until you've got your breathing because it is so important. Breathing is something that should be done without thinking. It should be natural to you. It should be second nature. The last thing you want to think about when you're on the stage singing is your breathing. It needs to just be there because you've got a whole host of other things to think about. Grieve four years out of your life to perfect your instrument, to become the master of your craft. Do it. Don't get frustrated if you don't get it. Just keep practicing. Best bit of advice I could give you is to warm up. It is so, so, so important. Always, always, always warm up. If my voice is dry, if you've got mucus, <clears throat> you're constantly doing this, <clears throat> that's generally mucus. And steaming will just lift that up. If you start steaming and you start coughing, that's what's happening, that's a good thing. It's it all coming up. But generally, if you have good technique, you know, every day's a good day. I mean, social media, God, it's all about that, isn't it? It's all about tweeting and how many Twitter followers you've got and how, ma how many YouTube, views you've got it really is this day and age and it, that's something that's actually just happened in the last couple of years promote 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 you know flog yourself do because record labels really take notice of that but it shouldn't be the be all and end all on twitter and facebook and youtube but as i say it's really really important to labels major labels these days if you are an artist and you're writing and you want to get out there go to everything go to open mics do whatever it takes to get yourself just out there. You can still do it the old-fashioned way. You can still send demos and you can still pester people. Again, meeting people. Get yourself down to jam night. That's how you meet people. And honestly, I know you hear all the time, if you do want something bad enough, you can have it. But it's hard work. Yeah,